Now let us talk about uh, the floating point data type that we have. That's the second primitive data type uh, in Apex. And we use floating point data type to store a numeric value with some decimal values also into it. So if you want to store a value like 3.14153, something like that, then we are going to use floating point data types. And again, floating point data types are divided into two subtypes. One double and the other one is decimal. Let's have a look at this program. So over here, this is how we basically declare a double va uh, variable with a double data type. This is how we assign a value. So have a look. We are assigning a value which has some decimal places value or decimal places with it. We cannot assign the same thing to an integer variable. We can only assign this to a double variable. So this is how we do it. And if you want to do it uh, both in one line, then this is how we can do it. And then comes decimal data type. Decimal data type also works similarly. Decimal DC1, DC1 is equals to 593.45 and then this. So both of, the, uh, both of these data types can be used as a floating point data type in Apex. Uh, but you must be wondering that what is the basic difference between both of them. Honestly speaking, there is no such difference. But there is a minute difference between both of them and that is that the currency fields that you create in Salesforce returns a decimal type value instead of your double type value. And decimal data type uh, has some more functions when it, com uh, when it comes to the decimal places or uh, when it comes to round rounding, off, round rounding off as compared to your double data type. So that's basically what the difference is.